Hello there guys, it's me Unstable Voltage. Welcome back to episode 10 of Civilization 6 as China. We finally met all of the other civilizations. They all hate us, they've all denounced us because we declared one little war. Uh, they all hated us pretty much before we declared the war, so there wasn't really an awful lot of loss to doing it. I still really want to go and settle another city up here. So I am going to... Do I want to be here or here? No, we want to be next to the fresh water. So we need to get ourselves another settler. And uh, I may just buy one, actually. Um, you're struggling with your housing cap anyway. Uh, so let me just go and purchase. Can we not purchase 720 gold? Wow. Okay, maybe not. Can't afford to buy one then. We maybe build one later on. That will be the last city that I settle. Uh, you are not doing much to develop a strong culture. What will we have to remember your people? So that's Brazil saying, that's Brazil not liking me because I don't have a strong culture. So as soon as the AI is just finished taking its turn there, let's just go and have a look at the cult civics tree, shall we? Okay, so Brazil are actually legitimately beating me in culture, but this is not usually the way things work. So we want to go and spread our religion to our own city. On to the next turn. We're getting there. Stuff's getting done. I'm really hoping that I can get the Ruhr Valley. Kabul wants a trade route. So we've met Kabul now. Unit needs orders. You are going to build a mine. Give us some more production down here. Sil wants us to recruit a great artist. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody hates us. So, you just need to sort of start spamming out theatre districts now. There's siege tactics done. So, let's go into printing, actually. We get printing nice and early. It will help our religion spread a little bit better. Um... Sewers will take ages, so let's go ahead and get the monument first. Is there anything else I need you to get? You can go over there and get that fish, I suppose. I know you're kind of backwards and forwards and all over the place right now, but... We're at one spread there. We'll do another spread over here, and it should start to get it organically. We won't have to micromanage the religion here too much. At least I hope we don't have to. Um, wow, England. Really? guess we'll be seeing about that then um we will need a melee unit of course um melee units we can get would be a swordsman we need two iron uh we don't have don't have any melee units at all because we don't have two iron That is ridiculous. Get a pikeman if we had 800 gold. Suppose it will have to be a pikeman. But I'm going to go down there and attack that city. Because that is a troll city right there, England. Um, I'm going to move down with this uh, crossbow as well. Such a cheeky place to settle a city. Because they're probably just trying to grab those spices. Now, it doesn't like they've got walls, so they shouldn't be too much of a threat to us, hopefully. Um, Renaissance walls. Holy sight, we don't really need. Theatre squares. We need theatre squares everywhere, basically. Uh, we don't have a tile for it, so is there anything else we can build in the meantime? Uh, we are near enough at the housing cap. Let's go ahead and get the sewers. We'll get you over there as well. On to the next turn. Really, that is a troll thing. Especially, right, that's England attacking me because I've strayed too close. But is that England or inside? Um... Oh, well, lost a unit. Never mind. England are inside the borders of the Aztecs. So does that mean they're at war with each other? Um, they are not. So they must just have open borders. Okay, that's fine. Unit needs orders then. Yeah, he's actually nicked the spices. I thought that's what was going to happen. So we have to take this city because I want my spices back. Um, Aztec Eagle Warrior, that's fine. 
So yeah, we're going to need 800 gold for the pipemen. We'll get that on the next turn. But that's such a troll city. When when we're at war and they they go and dump their um, they must be down here somewhere. Actually, England must be in this area that we haven't uncovered. But that is such a troll city there. Classic England, really. Um, let's go and spread there. Wasn't quite enough. How many cities does England have? Um, three, including Manchester. Well, we definitely want to take Manchester before um, we end this war. Simply because she's nicked my spices. So... Hopefully we can get in there and start doing some damage before she gets any walls up. The day we stop exploring. So we can change our policies here. We can change our government type. And we can pick up Merchant Republic. Give us some extra trade routes and discount on gold purchases. Uh, combat victories over units from earlier periods. Well, we're not doing a lot of combat, are we really? Um, production... Unit maintenance reduced. That might help a little. We need to get some spice still. Great writers we want. We also want great musicians. Great artists. Great artists, actually. Yeah, we've got uh, an art museum. So we'll do that. Choose a new civic. And what I want to do is head into urbanization. It's going to take a while, but we'll get it queued up. So let's move in. They don't even have any units in there. We have enough money to purchase a um, pikeman. Actually a bit cheaper now anyway. So we'll want to get a trader as soon as possible as well. I'm just going to bring, up, bring you up in case we need you. Oh, they've moved the catapult in there now. That's annoying. We might be able to outlast it. I really don't know. It is a promoted catapult. Let's see how much damage we can do. We've got a, we've actually got a promotion here. I'm going to save that. And we can use that as a cheap heal. Because look at that. We've already done a fair bit of damage to the city. Uh, choose a production. Um, you should probably get um, an archaeological museum. We don't have any archaeologists yet, but because we don't have the tech for it yet, but we will do. You need to get across the river, which is slowing us down. You need to get the fish. Then you've still got two builds left. You can go and get this um, fish up here, I suppose. Yeah, it's pretty much all we can do there. I still can't believe the audacity of that troll city stealing my spices. So hopefully we won't take too much damage on... Mind you, they're probably not going to fire because this is the thing, right? You can use a unit within a city to give the city basically more combat strength because the unit's garrisoned. However, if the unit attacks, it doesn't get the garrison... The city doesn't get the garrison bonus. So he's probably not going to bother attacking. Uh, we could get the armory here, but I think we're going to go for the amphitheatre. We are trying to get our culture up. You can go over there then and get that fish. I don't intend to keep this city. I intend to just burn it down. Because there's only one decent tile here. There's absolutely no point in keeping this city. So we will destroy it. It is my turn again. Again, it's it's so hard to get to it because of all of the uh, rubbish around it. But we will get it. Yes, I want you to move closer to the city, but you can't. Um, still got one more use left on that guy. I'd like to get this tile so I can great wall to it, but... Game be taking its time. I think we were spreading to that that one, weren't we? It was uh, still 16 turns. I'm sure it was 16 turns like 10 turns ago. What did well, there's printing done anyway. So now we can go into... Let's go into gunpowder. So we don't have to rely on iron for melee units then. Um, let's bring you home. 
Don't know what we're going to use to upgrade, to, uh, upgrade you, uh, with you yet. You've got a builder in there now. You've actually moved out with that catapult, so... Unfortunately, you don't have the range. What sort of tile is that? Get off. Just move in there. Got another catapult coming in. Let's move in with the crossbow. Let's move in with the pikeman. I'll try and finish these crossbow these units off if we can. Because we don't want them to be able to defend the city. That's the point. So, this should be a relatively straightforward kill. There we go. There's one unit down. You're just going to fortify. On to the next turn. Well, so much for a passive and peaceful game. I mean, I said I was going to try. I didn't say how hard. See, now she can't approve of the way that I govern... My, th my people, even though she's supposed to like people who are like, you know, warmongery. So the city's back up to full health now, which is annoying, but if we can clear out all of its units, it'll make life a lot easier for us. So that's what we're going to do. Um, you need to work on a sewer to improve your housing. You've got no production going on here at all. Um, so production tile, two production, uh, and then just work, oh, that's one production work that. So don't worry about the food and the gold, just work the production tiles. And it'll hopefully be a bit quicker. Not much, but it'll be a bit quicker. So on to the next turn, you're just going to start buying units now, aren't you? Well, that's fine. We'll just start bombarding the city a bit more. We need to do it before they get walls, though, ideally. Although you can't repair your walls when you're being attacked, so I wonder if you can actually build walls while you're being attacked. Tempted just to finish off the catapult, to be honest. We can claim a great person. We can get a great scientist. Triggers the Eureka moment for two random texts from the industrial or modern era and reveals oil without the normal technology requirement. Well, yeah, we'll go for that. So, uh, we have a trade. So, we could go to um, Hong Kong. Where were we going before? I think Hong Kong gives us a nice uh, nice spread of things. A bit of extra production. I'm sure that's where we were going before, if I'm honest. Um, you are going to go over there, and we'll pop you. So, we get a boost to ballistics, a boost to economics, and we can see where the oil is. Uh, there's none anywhere around us. We do have a little bit of money, so let's go ahead and buy a trader. Let's also make sure we buy at least one Inquisitor, and we get ourselves a missionary as well. Uh, nothing for you to do for a while, so we'll put you to sleep. You've only got one use left. It'll probably end up being that weak, if I'm honest. So, this is a lot of units that England are suddenly sending here. Carteros. See? And now she seems to like us again. Make up your mind. You were the first person to denounce me. So yeah, if we can get some of these units off the board, I will be happy. I don't mind that the city's recovering health. I just want to sort of get rid of stuff here. I don't want them being able to defend too heavily. Um, you are going to attack this. I mean, they've only got a couple of cities, so they're not really in a good spot to um, build a lot of stuff. Uh, let's go for the amphitheatres. Really want to try and get great writers as quickly as we can. This is a trader. You can go to Geneva, I guess. Everybody's denouncing us, and we are at war, so we don't necessarily want to be... Um, Yeah, let's send one over here. We don't necessarily want to be sending them too far and wide. Uh, you're just going to stay here in the city. In case somebody tries to spread their religion to us, we can remove it because we already have one of our own Inquisitors. Could do with another ranged unit down here, to be honest. 
don't really need us. any of that. So we can reach that catapult. Can't reach it with the Crouching Tiger. Right, what is your promotion? Range strength versus land units. Again, yeah, we might as well take it because we want to get the... Um, start getting XP towards our next promotion. Everything we hit at the moment doesn't give us any XP. And obviously the longer we let Manchester grow, the harder it's going to be to take. So we really want to sort of kill these units off. But I think we'll be able to manage that. So you are going to finish... Well, you're going to attack that unit. You're going to move here, actually. And finish that unit off. And you're going to go and finish the catapult off. So that's most of their units now cleared up. There we go. Right. Um, apparently we can afford another missionary, which is probably true. No, 170. Oh, we can afford another Inquisitor. Well, we don't want an Inquisitor. We want a missionary. 18 turns on the River Valley now. I'm not going to say anything. I don't want to jinx it. There's another Amphitheatre almost done. The Amphitheatre should, amphitheater should definitely help with us getting great writers more quickly. The real use of gun so there's gunpowder done. So, great people, great writers. Um, yeah, we're getting there slowly, but we are getting there. So do we have any nitre anywhere? There's some all the way up there. There's oil all the way up there. Still, I'm still thinking about grabbing that city. No nitre here. No nitre there. So yeah, again, we didn't have any iron within range. There's nitre, but none of that is really within range. I so say the strategic res I do like the change to the strategic resource system, but at the same time, it can make it very, very difficult actually trying to upgrade units. You've got housing problems and have had them forever. You need sewers, but at the same time, archaeological museum. So you've taken some damage now. That is fine, because you can just heal up. You're going to do damage to the city. You need to move in closer. And you are going to heal. On to the next turn. And they've just purchased that unit, I think. Uh, you want to give me iron and gold. You won't give me more gold, though. Would you give me... No, I don't really want two iron. Sure. I want to keep the iron for now in case we need to get any more units out. I really need two iron, though, to build units, but... See, Manchester's up to three population now. But it still isn't going to attack, and what I'm going to do now... Uh, that's enlightenment. I'm not too bothered about that. What we can probably do... is purchase a catapult... We, we need some siege down here. It's going to take forever. You're going to move in closer and spread religion. Fantastic. So our religion is actually spreading around now. So we've got time for a couple more turns. We might be able to do something here. So we'll keep attacking the city. Got to keep doing that until the catapult gets there. Which will take a lot of turns. Uh, so, you... Oh, Hong Kong's already got our religion. So, I guess we start heading back over and do the other two cities that still haven't got our religion yet. That's fine. As soon as that catapult gets there, this will this will go really quickly. We'll take this city out and then we'll peace out with England. That's kind of the plan at this point. Still need to get another trader up and running. Don't judge so there's metal casting. Can we upgrade you? No, because we need nitre. I don't suppose for one moment you have nitre, do you? We're probably ahead in terms of uh, tech. So nobody probably has nitre anyway. So that's a shame. Uh, so we'll just keep moving in. 
all of the territory we've taken and this is another reason why you really need to go wide in civilization 6 because if you don't go wide you've got next to no chance of getting the strategic resources needed to build any military units so you know ballistic seems a little bit pointless when we don't have nitre as does chemistry and everything else but we'll go for ballistics anyway we need to get some nitre it is an important thing you are going to go for an art museum. We'll try and get sort of art and archaeology in equal measures. Found another flipping tribal village. They're coming in with another settler. That's interesting. I really want to get that, to be honest. So we'll, we'll tell it to do that. Uh, unit needs orders. Right, you're going to move in. Yeah, they are moving in with a fair few units here. Let's... um. Rid you of a few of them. I don't know what you think you're doing with that settler. Be interesting to see if they try and move it into the city. Um, you are just going to stay fortified. Yeah, they've moved away with it now. Oh, wow. Where did all of these units just suddenly come from? Now, well, that's a problem. So the question is, can I take their city faster than they can take my city? Because we don't even have walls there. It's down to the red. I'm actually going to attack with uh, this unit as well. Now, they've still got to disembark with a, a, a lot of units. The, the terrain's not going to help them out. I do have a crossbow up here that I'm going to very, very slowly start to head down there to, to do something with. Unit needs orders. You can't get that because some idiot's standing on top of it, so we'll have to do that on the next turn. I'm not going to end this video until this is resolved because this is far too flipping tense for that. I, I, I really don't care, Pedro. Just do one yeah so he's coming in but he's he hasn't actually made his attack yet so i should be able to take this on this turn and then peace out that's the plan that's what i'm going for because we so say we don't even have walls here so that was a little bit ballsy on my part Okay, you can actually reach that chariot, so hit it anyway. You're doing like next to no damage to it, but XP is XP. You can take Manchester. So, do we want to keep it? I mean, there's crab. There's the spices. It's the wrong religion. We would get more warmonger penalty if we burnt it down. And we can always remove it. I think we will keep it, you know. We'll keep the city. Actually shows it's occupied now. That's cool. Um, so now that we have that, let's go and speak to Victoria. She's actually not willing to cede it. That suddenly made this um, a lot more interesting, hasn't it? Thaki one might fall here. Can we purchase a unit in here that we could do anything with? No. Well. Oh well. I guess we're going to see what happens with that on the next video. Beforehand though, we do want to sort of build something over here. Let's start building a monument. And uh, let's grab that. 20 faith really wasn't worth it we'll put you back on auto explore but that is all i can do on this turn so i'm going to end the video there when we come back next time we'll have to see if we can save thaki one it's a little bit well it's all my own fault really didn't have any walls built they totally slipped by me with all of these units i certainly did not expect them to come in with all of these hopefully we'll have enough money soon to be able to build something or buy something we have um 330, 3, 535 gold 
to buy Crouching Tiger. We could get that in a few turns if we can hold out that long. Uh, we are starting to move down with uh, uh, with a crossbow. That will take a little bit of time. But I'll start to move down with uh, these units as well now. I'll definitely start moving down with this crossbow as quickly as we can. But we'll have to see what happens next time. So thanks a lot for watching, guys. Hope you're still enjoying Civilization VI. Until then, goodbye for now.